Hey, it's Shay, and welcome back to another Mommy Monday. If you are new here, I would love for you to hit that subscribe button down below and join the family. Today is all about self-care and self-love. Being a mom is a very demanding job, okay? I am a first-time mom, and my baby is four months now. And if you are not new to my channel, then you know when I break out the red robe, it's gonna be a pamper routine. And I've actually had two other pamper routine videos on my channel if you want to go check that out. I have a back to school pamper routine and I also have a pregnancy pamper routine. So I just love to take care of myself. I'm really big on that self-love, self-care. But if you are a mom like myself, it is important to take some time away from your motherly duties and show yourself some love. So let the kids hang out with daddy or with a friend, or if that's not possible, do this while they're asleep. My pamper routine these days are fairly quick, but very effective, okay? And it makes me feel good um, and definitely is important to me. I like to keep my routines within that hour mark, just in case, depending on the time of the day. Right now, my baby's with his dad, so I can take as long as I'd like. So let's get right into it. As you guys saw, I have my mommy milk tea, mother's milk, I think that's what it's called. And I'm gonna be sipping on this my entire routine. So I'm gonna start off with this face wash. You've probably seen me use this a million times on my channel. Uh, this is the only face wash I use. I've been using it for a couple of years now and it works perfect for my dry skin. I kind of do want to switch it up, but I just haven't found any face wash that works as good as this one. So if you guys have any suggestions, let me know. So of course I'm going to be doing a face mask because a pamper routine is not official unless you have a face mask. So I'm going to be using this honey and mint clay mask that I got from Pink. And this is an exfoliating clay mask. So um, once, you once you rinse it off, which I'm going to do while I'm in the shower, once you rinse it off, it exfoliates your face while you're rinsing it off. So you just scrub, scrub, scrub. This is why I really like this mask and it smells really good. I'm looking in the mirror here um, and I don't have my glasses on so I can't really see that well but I'm gonna make it work so I don't know how crazy I look I don't know if I'm missing any spots you guys my vision is really bad it's, I have really poor vision like seriously but I didn't feel like putting my contacts on I just don't feel like wearing contacts right now before I hop in the shower, I'm going to apply this beet for hair removal and I'm actually looking for something else to use for hair removal because my fiance cannot stand the smell of this stuff and neither can I. And for body wash, I'm using this detoxifying charcoal body wash and when I do my pamper routine, I like to use two different body washes when I wash up the second time. I'm going to use this aromatherapy body wash which smells amazing and of course, you have to exfoliate and I got this oat scrub from Pink. So since clay mask can be a little bit on the drying side, I'm going to follow up with this Daily Hydration Milk Mask by Shea Moisture. This is actually going to be my first time using this. Um, I just love to use a mask that's going to help uh, suck out all the dirt out of my pores and you know, it could be a little drying. And then I like to follow that up with a hydration mask. I actually have the shampoo um, in the Shea Moisture line, so I'm interested to see how this mask works. to soften and restore my skin let's see how good this works 
So now I'm going to moisturize my entire body and I'm actually running out of this. I use this on my body and my face. This is a body oil by Atara. I definitely need to replenish and get a bigger size. I love, love, love this stuff. It is homemade oil and this is a black owned business. So if you guys are interested in checking her out, I will leave her Instagram down below. This oil is a mango scented oil and it smells absolutely amazing. She has flowers infused in this. And uh, I think she calls it like 2K gold. I don't know if you can see those gold pieces. I love it. Okay. So I'm going to put this all over my body, except for my feet, because I'm going to do something really quick to my feet. Again, I'm trying to make this pamper routine as fast as I can, because when you're a mom, you don't have time to be going all out. As you can see, I didn't do my usual bubble bath, because I actually haven't had a bubble bath since my son was born. But I wanted to make it as quick as possible, but also still feel like I'm pampering myself. And what I love about this oil, oh my gosh, I'm so sad that I'm running out. I need to revamp. I need to definitely order some more of this. What I love about this oil is that it is not oily. Like, coconut oil, I love coconut oil, but it is so freaking oily. Like, you get in your bed with coconut oil on, your sheets are guaranteed to be ruined. Uh, so I love this because it's not oily, but it's so moisturizing. This is my first time trying this product, and I'm definitely going to be a returning customer. So shout outs to Atara. She doesn't know me, but girl, I love your products. So super quick, I'm going to do my nails and my feet. My nails are a little bit too long. I have a four month old and I can't be scratching him. So I'm gonna cut my nails down a little bit and file them. I don't wear nail polish currently because like I said, I have a little baby and if I have to put my hands in his mouth, I just don't feel comfortable with having nail polish on my nails. And if you know me, you know how much I love having my nails done. So this is a little bit hard for me, but you got to do what you got to do. So moving on to the feet, I have not done my feet. I've been neglecting them for way too long. So I don't have time to sit around and soak them like I normally would. So I'm just going to do a really super quick pedicure. I just need them to look at least halfway decent for now. So now I'm going to wash the mask off and it actually kind of disappeared into my skin. So I'm just using a warm washcloth to wipe that off. This mask was actually pretty moisturizing, I'm not going to lie. I definitely will be using it again. Since I am pampering myself, I wanted to do a little extra step while I brush my teeth. I'm using my magic mud charcoal powder so this is supposed to be a whitening tooth powder and it doesn't work if you just use it once so i'm going to try my best uh to use this for one week straight and see if i can see a difference in my teeth so i wanted to use try out this um hair and scalp serum by shea moisture my scalp has been feeling a little dry and itchy lately and I wanted to try a serum instead of an oil because I've never used this before and I must say that this stuff really 
helps. I've seen a difference with just one use, to be honest. My head is not itchy anymore. I don't know if that's what it's supposed to do, but it's definitely helping me. And I'm just going to massage that into my scalp for a couple of minutes, get a nice head massage going. Oh my god, it felt so good. This is really good for hair growth. It stimulates hair growth, so... So that is it for my mommy pamper routine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you do not miss out on any of my future Mommy Mondays. I love you guys and I can't wait to see you in my next video.